So ladies and gentlemen, it's time to get the action started by welcoming first, fighting out of the blue corner, he represents Diesel Jim in London. Please welcome, standing more, So hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to an absolute scorcher of a show in the Hitman Fight League versus CFS. I'm Eddie Shawman, I'm absolutely beside myself as usual to bring you an absolute scorcher and I mean red hot show here tonight. Well we've got an absolutely stacked card and we have a fantastic announcement for you that will change the face of Muay Thai in the UK and possibly around the world. With me is a former two-time British champion, European champion, and all sorts of champion stuff going on. Gavin Serry, Gav, what a show we've got. Yeah, again, we're back here again, aren't we, Vin? It's uh, absolute guaranteed fireworks every time we come in this show. Well matched, well run, and every single fight's a banger. Thank you indeed. So we have a very, very exciting card here tonight, and making his way to the ring is Stanimar. Tasselov, I hope I've said that Stanimo. right. Svetko! Svelkov. Svetkov. Well, he said that very well, Gav. And facing this evening in the red corner, he represents the South End Combat Academy. Please welcome Billy Carter. So Bill Carter then from the South End Combat Academy, a really good gym as well. Also opposing him, he's standing here. He's from the Diesel Gym and they are very well established gyms here in the southern part of our wonderful country, honest to God, tonight. We are absolutely jam-packed. You know what, Gav? It's a sellout event, and I can see why the card is going to be absolutely stacked. These are C-class uh, fights, ladies and gentlemen. N-class fights, I should say. Three two-minute rounds. So they are just making their way, cutting their teeth, and wanting to get on the main card eventually, and maybe, maybe on some bigger shows later on if they carry on this very, very tough an arduous career, we will see. Our referee is Mr. Chris Bachelodori, who's no introduction in the world over. And our MC is the luscious Lee Thompson. And we're just starting here. And it's going to be an axe and patch card. We've seen him warming upstairs, didn't we, Bill Carter? He looks sharp, Gavin. Yeah, he did look sharp. I think these fights are always, you know, they're always fast Billy starts as well. So uh, I think we can expect uh, the start to go off from both men to, to go at it and not really hang about three Indeed. two minute rounds. Trying to get the work in, three two minute rounds well, of ladies action. Ladies and gentlemen, live from so London, we'll three two minute rounds of M class Muay Thai rules in the 64 kilogram division. Your referee in charge when the bell rings, Mr. Chris Spatchledore. So I said, ladies and gentlemen, three two-minute rounds of action. Diesel Jim and the South End Combat Academy. You remember that Natty Dodds had that really good fight against Ben Can. Yeah. I ruined one of my favourite suits, yeah, there, Gav. Some fight that wasn't it. It was indeed. 64 kilos is the weight, ladies and gentlemen. What's these two Round eager to one. get going? Round one. Strong guard from Stamineer. Stamineer there, Gav, just switching southpaw now is yeah. Bill Carter. Sweet. Nice sweep there. Heavy on the front leg. Stamineer, Gav, you can see where the target area for the low kick is. Yeah, he's he took a couple of low kicks already this, 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 this round there. Listening well, Bill Carter. Yep. Chin a little bit high of, of Bill Carter, though, Gav. Yeah, he's eager, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> nice leg kicks coming back from. Nice timing. Standing here, yeah. Timing his shots well. That's better. Good leg kicks exchanging here. Kind of corner there, shouting the basics, obviously. Just use the jab and the low kicks to stick to the bread and butter techniques of. This art. High kick attempt grabs that, sweeps the leg. Nice leg kick Landing there. Heavy. Yeah. Nice, nice regular. He stepped right across yeah, there, didn't just 
a few times in this round. He's stepped right across and he's landed it really, really thick. Good right Good hand round. there from... Nice basics. Stamina, yes. Really, both of them, to be yeah, honest. Yeah. Nice combinations going in off each. Time to get wise to the leg kick now. Stamina. I think Zelkov holds the, holds, the, holds the advantage in power. I think Carter can feel that because he, he, he's, he's sometimes looking a little bit. He's getting backed up, he's looking a little bit jittery and he's just putting stuff out, he's not putting out there of any authority. you got to understand, ladies and gentlemen, if you've just joined us here, this is the beginning of our card that's going to be an absolutely stacked event. And as I've been saying, and there's the uh, no cats out of the bag on this one, there is going to be an announcement later on that was going to change everything in the world of Muay Thai and kickboxing, we'll see. So, first round there, bit of even Stevens there, Gavin. No one really dominating that, would you say? No, I would say that of the two that would be probably happier, I would say uh, Spelkoff would be much happier because I think he, he inflicted a bit more damage onto Carter uh, than, than the, the other way around. So we just see this round now, he's gonna, I think this round now he's going to go up a couple of gears, both men are, and just see if he goes back to kicking that leg again because he was, he was successful with that. Yeah, he started to bring more out of his, out of his locker, yeah, didn't he? Was, he? he was throwing some good hands as well, good right hands. Round well two. Well balanced. Round two, then. Straight like kicks exchange it. again. Yeah. One each. <laughs> similar in stature and similar in technique though, aren't they, both yeah. of these? Yeah, long, long straight shots. Whoa! Oh, yeah, straight out of the ring there, should have... No need if that's out of order, no, that. No, no, I don't think Chris will like that. No. Yeah, he's not letting that go. Experienced referee Chris Bachelador just being taking authority and show he should. And he's, he's a young guy, his emotions run high, it's a novice contest. I'm sure it's just he's, he's saying sorry, and yeah, I understand. There we go. So standing here replies with technique. That's how you should reply, really. Looks a bit more relaxed. Yeah. Mostly caught up, isn't he, Bill Carter? Yeah, yeah, he seems really invested in this, and as opposed to would be, but... So he's taking some good shots now. Yeah. Starting to put things together, though, better now. Standing stand here, just bringing out his talent, isn't he, really, here? Good kick. Good body High shot. on the body, yeah. He's, he's really looking for that. He looked for that yeah. in the first round as well. It's not an easy task anyway, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sure you'll agree. However... That leg's gone. Yeah, the leg's going to go. He's just yeah. chopping away, isn't he? Have all the yeah. time with that right yeah. kick to the leg. Again, he catches Carter. <laughs> Keeping his shape as well, isn't he? Yeah, he's not getting flustered. The high kick nice was nice. Pace. Caught on the side of the chin. That leg's gone. Needs to step, yeah. really step into that as he yeah. moves as yeah. well. Good round, I give that to, to Stam in here. Started to put the technique to better, together well, didn't he, Gavin? And after that debacle where he got nearly got thrown out of the ring there, and Chris rightly so did what he had to do, and then he started to get himself together and emotionally he's connected himself, hasn't he? Yeah, I think with these fights sometimes it's it's not some it's obviously it comes down to technique and who's the better fighter, but it also a lot of the big big factor is who settles the who settles first. And and it always looked like uh, you know, Stanimir was gonna be the one to settle first. He just kept he kept on with the basics, he kept plugging away at that leg, didn't lose his shape at all. And I love the two of them now, he looks far more relaxed. You look at Bill Carter in the corner and you look at um, standing here in the corner, and, and there's a world of difference between the two. Yep. So, going to the final well, round. Well, ladies round and gentlemen, three. let's have a huge three, three, round of applause for the third this. and final round. 
Sporting Hugs, you're going to the third round, let's see. Does that sweep well, but he got caught with a few techniques before that. Showboating has to go to his body, but the reddening says otherwise, Gav. It's no good showboating than getting caught with it. No. But the novices aren't they, Gavin? They're going to yeah, do yeah, things yeah. that yeah, are out of the ordinary. Just, yeah, of course they've got to do it and to, to learn from it and, and, and then move forward. Always staying on that leg, just bread and butter techniques and just landing that leg kick good, blocking as well. Both good gyms, well respected in the game. Diesel and Southend Combat Academy. And whatever happens tonight, they can they can certainly come again with the level of teaching they have at these gyms, Cap. Oh yeah, both both men have uh, given a good account of it, good, good, good account of themselves. Trading a low kick there, that was nice. Yep. There's a level of experience as well in the clinch when they get in the clinch that, yeah, they spurt, that it shows yeah, as well. They spurt the work a little bit. Yeah. Um, on the back foot all the time this round and in the second round, so it's going to look on the score against him, really. He's lacking the balances. Stamina just dropping the leg kicks in all the time. Stan is affectionately known by his corner. Good fight, fair play to both teams and both boxers. And we've got that, I believe, on Gavin's unofficial scorecards for a drop on you, Gav. <laughs> if anyone complains, I blame you and you're bigger than me. <laughs> So we'll see. Stunning Mar then. So holds his hand aloft. Good way to open the show. Yeah, of course. And you know what? Listen, it's an end class contest. And uh, it's not easy. Got to give these two credit. So as our judges deliberate. Another chin wag. Our MC, Lee Thompson, with the decision. Well, ladies and gentlemen, a fantastic way to start the show. Let's have a round of applause for these warriors. Come on. And after three fantastic rounds of Muay Thai action, we go to the judges' scorecards. When they have reached the unanimous decision, let's hear it for your winner in the blue corner, Stanimo Zvetko. There's more consistency with the technique, and I'm sure. And your brilliant runner up, Billy Carter. I'm sure he's, uh, he'll be back again, uh, Billy Carter. Fair play to Billy and his team, and also the good guys down at the both uh, gyms, the Diesel Gym and South End Combat Academy. So that's how we start it, ladies and gentlemen. We kick off, literally, with an class contest. And we'll be having a break later on. And at six o'clock, we'll start our main card. And just before that, a very, very special announcement indeed.